what is up Frank at Red Pill Racing what you looking at right here is the final lineup possible DCR cars as of last testing these four were the ones that were going to go we got the brand new flatbird thing been stripped and sanded smooth it's got some nice wheels I believe he is the fastest we got the red pill 57 you can tell they were just graphite it up we got the blue 57 we got the Gran Torino. Now I got some other cars here that I finished building just for this race. We got the Monte Carlo. We got the old school. This was a red line 442. And the one I'm excited to test is this bad boy, the Corvette. Now the other exciting thing is the new track setup. Check it out. Thanks to uh League of Speed for the idea of removing the handle which wasn't possible before because I didn't have a permanent setup but now that it's here handle's been removed you can see the string has been tied into the bottom for the pull runs down and if you're wondering what this is that is the even more exciting part of course the string runs on down so I can actually pull it from down here but when I pull the string this that you're looking at here is one of the photo sensors for the 3d bot maker timer so what that means when I pull this string triggers the sensor timer begins and then down at the end it triggers it and I get a time. Like that was 7.7 seconds. So from now on I'll be able to actually do some really accurate testing with my cars. And I find out what's going to save me a tenth of a second here or there. So what I'm going to do is I have four track passes for DCR and to tell you the truth if I don't win this thing this year I'm going to be disappointed I feel like since last year I've put the work in that I got a shot at this so what I'll do first I'm just going to race I know these two were probably the fastest we're going to race these two, the Blue 57, the Gran Torino, make sure they lined up, and we'll have the same format as we did before, you know, where one each lane, however, if it is a split, we will not run again, we will go by whoever had the fastest time in lane one. So, let's stop talking about it, let's race. And of course, a terrible start on the first run. Look at that, my string broke. How the hell did my string break? One second. in there and look at that <laughs> what's the odds of that nonsense I've tested this thing 50 times so it looks like I'll be needing to upgrade the string but for now we're going to tie a little knot in this bad boy Let's see if we can get it to fix at least run for this video Alright, 
Get back down here. Get we got to 2.557, but we're gonna run them again. Don't have a lot of space on this memory card, so we gotta do it a little fast. Forgot to reset the timer. 3D bot maker. So here we go, let's try it again. Two point three seven eight. That's more like it. That is fast. Reset the timer. Back to zero. Fifty seven smoked him with a two point three seven eight. We swap in lanes. 57 again pretty fast time though but the 57 is indeed the third fastest so we're going to run the Torino against a 442 see if he knocks him out I really like the way that car turned out hopefully he's got some speed in him we about to find out right now in just a second. If I can keep remembering to do this timer. There we go. Ready. Mm, Torino got smoke. He did run a 2.405. We'll swap them up. Torino in two. Four four two in lane one. A two point three eighty four. Torino's gone. Now, 2.384. We got a Monte Carlo in the 4.42. I really think that Monte Carlo is going to be fast. Will he beat a 2.384? Ooh, they close. Same exact time. But the 4.42 outran him on the track. We gotta reset them. Alright, here we go. Winner, lane two. And those are close. 2.386. But the 442 won both races, so. Looks like he's still in there. But I got a feeling this whole ugly, unfinished vet is going to be badass. Let's find out real quick. 442. We're going to be racing the vet. Reset the timer. There we go. like something happened on that start. I'll do it one more time. Just for fun, let's see what the T-Bird will run. The last little bit of testing you'll see. I just really wanted to show you the new track setup. It's pretty nice. Two point three nine five. There we go. Hope you guys like the track. I'll be back with some more racing. See ya.